You got good hair. I'm going to compliment your hair. It's going a little bit, though. I'm it's going? It. Yeah. I'm, You're losing it? I've been losing it since. I, it's like, I mean, if I really get up in there, guys, I mean, it's like starting to disappear. Right. So I, when I was like 25, I noticed it was starting to go. And so I went to the, I went and met the guy, the doctor, the hair guy doctor. And he was like, uh, he put me on this, this medication called Avidart. Have you ever heard of this stuff? No. So anyway, it's like a finasteride, and it w and, and and what's it? Wait, now now I need to know what that is. So basically, <laughs> finasteride. It's like a hydroxidil. Yeah. So your or a glucosamate. Well, I don't know what it is. So your body produces testosterone, and then a well, byproduct uh -huh. of well, <laughs> some do, some don't. Uh, so. <laughs> I'm a heavily testosteronated, uh, yeah. I don't even know if that's a word. Any which way, the byproduct of testosterone actually causes follicles to mm -hmm. get weaker and fall out. And right. so you take this stuff and it washes away the, 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 the byproduct of testosterone. Right. But we don't know what else that might be used, being used for that could be good in the body. But any which way, so I've been like holding on to the hair pretty good. Right. But then when we decided that we were going to have children, I didn't know what, you know, was it okay? Is it safe to take when you're maybe, having Maybe a baby? you shouldn't be on that if you're uh, trying to have a baby. Yeah. So I stopped taking the stuff about three years ago, and now I'm experiencing the hair loss.